On a U.S. Navy aircraft carrier, the flight deck is a highly organized and efficient workspace where every second counts. One key aspect of this organization is the use of color-coded jerseys. The use of these distinct colors allows crew members to quickly identify each other's roles amidst the high-paced activity on the flight deck. This system not only facilitates communication, but also enhances operational safety by ensuring that everyone is aware of who is responsible for what tasks during critical flight operations. As aviation support equipment technician First Class Chanel Jordan noted, different color jerseys help us identify who needs to be where and who is accountable for certain roles. This color-coded system allows for quick identification of personnel, which is essential in the fast-paced and often chaotic environment of a flight deck. Yellow shirts are responsible for directing and managing all aircraft movement on the flight deck and hangar bay. This includes coordinating the safe passage of planes, avoiding collisions, and ensuring smooth transitions between taxing, launching, and landing processes. In high-stress environment, the yellow shirts must remain vigilant and precise. Their ability to coordinate multiple aircraft simultaneously is crucial for maintaining safety standards. Selected yellow shirts occupy strategic positions in the primary flight control, PriFly. There, they act as the air boss and mini boss, overseeing the entire flight operation. Green jerseys. Green jerseys on U.S. Navy aircraft carriers signify a variety of critical roles primarily focused on maintenance and operational support. These crew members are essential for ensuring the functionality and safety of the equipment used during flight operations. Here's a detailed explanation of the responsibilities associated with green jerseys. Green shirts are primarily responsible for operating and maintaining the catapult systems that launch aircraft off the carrier and the arresting gear that safely stops them upon landing. This equipment is vital for the successful execution of flight operations as it directly impacts the safety and efficiency of launching and recovering aircraft. One of the more dangerous tasks performed by green-shirted personnel is that of hook runners. After an aircraft lands, it often catches one or more arresting cables with its tail hook to come to a stop. Hook runners must quickly run up the aircraft to free any entangled cables, ensuring that they can be reused for subsequent landings. This task requires agility and quick reflexes, as it must be done while ensuring safety on the busy flight deck. Green jerseys also include personnel who perform routine maintenance on various types of aircraft, including advanced fighter jets like the Boeing FAES 18EF Super Hornet. They conduct inspections, troubleshoot issues, and ensure that all systems are operational before aircraft are cleared for flight. In addition to aircraft maintenance, green-shirted sailors are responsible for the troubleshooting ground support equipment. This includes everything from tow tractors to electrical systems that support flight operations. Some green shirts serve as mass communication specialists, often acting as photographers' mates who document flight operations and events on the carrier. Their work helps maintain a historical record and provides valuable training materials. Green jerseys also include personnel tasked with signaling helicopters during takeoff and landing operations. These individuals play a crucial role in coordinating safe landings and departures in a highly dynamic environment. Red jerseys. Red jerseys on U.S. Navy aircraft carriers signify a range of critical roles that involve handling hazardous materials, ordnance, and participating in crash and salvage operations. Here is a detailed explanation of the responsibilities associated with red jerseys. Red shirts are primarily responsible for loading and unloading ordnance, including bombs, missiles, mines, and ammunition onto aircraft. This task requires careful handling and transportation of heavy loads, sometimes exceeding 300 pounds per missile, such as the advanced medium-range air-to-air missile, AMRAAM. Besides loading ordnance, red shirts also form part of the crash and salvage crews. These teams are trained to respond rapidly to emergencies such as fires or crashes on the flight deck. They participate in firefighting operations using mini-fire trucks specifically designed for shipboard use.
Another critical duty of red-shirted sailors is explosive ordnance disposal. They handle and dispose of explosive devices found on the carrier or elsewhere, ensuring the safety of all personnel on board. The choice of red for these roles is psychologically significant. Red is often associated with danger and urgency, which aligns perfectly with the high-risk nature of their duties. This color coding helps in instant recognition and respect from fellow crew members, emphasizing the gravity of their responsibilities. Purple Jerseys Purple jerseys on U.S. Navy aircraft carriers are worn by personnel responsible for handling all aviation fuel on board. Often referred to as grapes, are tasked with refueling all aircraft on the flight deck and in the hangar bay. This includes ensuring that each aircraft receives the correct type and amount of fuel, specifically JP-5 jet fuel, which is a high flashpoint kerosene that meets military specifications. Beyond just refueling, purple-shirted personnel oversee the entire fueling process. They inspect fuel supplies, ensuring they are free from contaminants such as water and sediment before use. This quality control is vital to prevent engine failures during flight operations. Purple jerseys also manage the replenishment of fuel supplies while the carrier is underway. This involves coordinating with supply ships to ensure that the carrier remains adequately fueled for extended missions. The personnel in purple jerseys are responsible for maintaining and servicing all equipment related to fuel handling. This includes hoses, pumps, and storage tanks, ensuring that all systems are operational and safe to use. Blue jerseys. Some blue jerseys on U.S. Navy aircraft carriers signify a variety of critical roles primarily focused on handling and maneuvering aircraft on the flight deck. Here is a detailed explanation of the responsibilities associated with blue jerseys. Blue shirts are responsible for immobilizing planes when they are not in flight. This involves running around the deck to chase tires and secure the aircraft by chaining down their tires to prevent rolling with the ship's movement. Blue shirts also operate the aircraft elevators, which are high-speed hydraulic platforms that move planes from the hangar bay to the flight deck and vice versa. Blue shirt eyes operate motorized equipment such as tractors and forklifts, which are used to move planes and cargo around the carrier's flight deck. Blue shirts also serve as communicators or phone talkers, aiding in coordinating movements and instructions between different sections of the flight deck. In summary, blue jerseys indicate personnel who are deeply involved in the daily operations of an aircraft carrier's flight deck. Brown jerseys. Brown jerseys on U.S. Navy aircraft carriers are worn by personnel known as plane captains. These individuals play a vital role in ensuring the safety and readiness of aircraft before and after flight operations. Here's a detailed explanation of their responsibilities and significance. Plane captains are responsible for conducting thorough inspections of their assigned aircraft before flight. This includes checking critical systems such as engines, hydraulics, and avionics to ensure everything is functioning properly. They verify that all necessary maintenance has been performed and that the aircraft is safe for operation. After an aircraft returns from a mission, brown shirts conduct post-flight checks to assess any potential issues that may have arisen during the flight. This involves documenting any discrepancies and coordinating with maintenance personnel to address them promptly. Brown-shirted personnel maintain direct communication with pilots, providing essential information regarding the aircraft's condition and any specific concerns that may affect flight operations. During repositioning of aircraft on the flight deck or in the hangar, plane captains often occupy the cockpit as brake riders. This role involves managing the aircraft's controls while it is being moved, ensuring safety and proper handling. White jerseys. The last is the white shirts, who have a role as safety and medical personnel. They encompass several critical roles aimed at ensuring safety standards are met. These include squadron plane inspectors who conduct thorough safety inspections of aircraft. Quality assurance and safety observers verify adherence to procedural guidelines, preventing potential hazards. Liquid oxygen crews replenish the air supply required by each aircraft, ensuring continuous functionality. Landing signal officers, LSOs, usually former pilots, are tasked with clearing the flight deck for incoming aircraft 
and assisting during landing phases when necessary. Finally, medical personnel fall under this category, providing immediate care in case of injuries sustained during operations. Understanding these roles provides insight into how meticulously orchestrated each segment of air operations is on a U.S. Navy aircraft carrier. The use of color-coded jerseys serves as a visual shorthand, facilitating quick identification and coordination among diverse teams working towards common goals under intense conditions.